every day Think when you wake up Today I am fortunate To have woken up I am alive I have a precious human life Welcome, friends. Thank you for joining us in activated heart space as we come together as a community. Abraham is on the call and he is not available to join us, so let's send us some love. Um, they are traveling to a doctor's appointment today, but are so pleased um, at our commitment to continue to practice together and show up in these ways with one another. So let's, let's start by putting our feet on the ground, breathing into our heart space, just arriving into our being. And, and take a look around, who's here? on our screens, putting on gallery view. This is our practice. This is our commitment that we have to ourselves and to one another. So let's open with the invocation. And perhaps we can start with our wonderful friend down in Chile, Nur Jahan. Hacia el uno, la perfección del amor, la armonía y la belleza. El único ser, unidos con todas las almas iluminadas que forman la manifestación del Maestro, del Espíritu de Guía. Thank you. Aliyala. Would you speak in Russian? Единому, совершенству любви, гармонии и красоты, единственно сущему, объединяясь со всеми просветленными душами, которые образуют воплощение мастера, путеводный дух. Thank you. Asaf, are you here? I think I see you. Can you unmute? Verso l'uno, la perfezione di amore, armonia e bellezza. L'essere unico, uniti a tutte le anime illuminate che formano l'incarnazione del Maestro, lo spirito della guida. I see Alona is here. Are you able to unmute? Yeah. Well, I say in Ukrainian. Okay. Do you dinaha? Does canala still bovi harmonia ta krasi? Do you dina snuichila? Abjedna nagazo sima prasvitla nami dushami, yaki utvoriuch silnia maestra, duch darugo pas.
לקראת האחד, שלמות של אהבה, תפארת ויופי. היחיד מייהד בתוהו את כל הנשמות הנאורות, המייצרות את אילגמות המשלט, הרוח הקודש. And Sharon in, in French? Perlin, la perfection de l'amour, de la harmonie et de la beauté. L'être unique, unisse à tous les âmes illuminées qui forment l'incarnation du maître, l'esprit d'orientation. Thank you. Tajali, would you be able to do it in signing with us? Toward the one, the perfection of love, harmony, and beauty, the only being united with all the illuminated souls who form the embodiment of the master. the spirit of guidance. Mm. Mm. And all together. Thank you. Bismillah. Bismillah. Erramakma. Erramakma. Mm. And I'm going to now turn it over to our beloved Amrita. Okay, so hello everyone. This is usually Abraham's um, part with the purification breaths, but here I am tonight. Here we are tonight and um, all breathing this one breath, often given the name Allah. So here we are all breathing the one breath all around the world. And before we um, do the purification breaths, I'd like to read a prayer. Make peace with the land, for the land is my body. Make peace with the waters, for the waters are my blood. Make peace with the fire, for the fire is my light. Make peace with the air, for the air is my breath. Make peace with the ether. for the ether is my soul. So we can keep that in mind when we're going through the different breaths and remembering that what we put on our breath makes a difference. And when we breathe, we're taking in the prana, which helps to purify our being. So we begin with the earth breath, where we're breathing in through the nose and out through the nose And we place on our breath Yashafi and Yakafi. So Yashafi as we breathe in, Yakafi as we breathe out. And five breaths for healing of the earth element in us and around us. And we give thanks, thanks to the element of earth. And now we move to the 
element of the water breathing in through our nose and out through our mouth the healing of the waters of our body and the waters of the world um, the beautiful rain that's falling here in the winter in Australia the dew on the grass the oceans the rivers the flowing aspect so breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth being aware of the all-pervading life in space the prana that we breathe in and that we breathe out the great exchange that happens between us all the time the giving and receiving five breaths yashafi on the in breath yakafi on the out breath We give thanks to the element of water and we move to the element of fire. Make peace with the fire for the fire is my light that, that transforms. Breathing in through the mouth and out through the nose of fire. Five breaths. Yashafi on the in breath, Yakafi on the out breath. And we give thanks for the element of fire and we move to the element of the air. We breathing in through the mouth and out through the mouth. Yashafi on the in breath, Yakafi on the out breath. The element of air.
and we give thanks for the element of air and we move to ether the breath of sometimes known as stillness or spaciousness and we're breathing either in through the nose and out through the nose very refined breath or in through the nose and out through the, with, with the nose and the mouth in and out either one yashafi on the in breath yakafi on the out breath feeling the spaciousness and the stillness of all the elements being aware of the breath that connects us all we'll seal the practice with the prayer nayas and let us see nujahan would you say the prayer amado dios todopoderoso a través de los rayos del sol a través de las ondas del aire, a través de la vida que todo lo impregna en el espacio, purifícanos y revivifícanos y te pedimos que sanes nuestros cuerpos, corazones y almas. Amén. And Norana, Naomi, would you say the prayer? Or Hebrew? I don't know it in Hebrew. No? no. Okay, in English. Yeah. Okay. Beloved Lord, Almighty God, through the rays of the sun, through the waves of the air, through the all pervading life in space, purify and revivify us. And we pray, heal our bodies, hearts, and souls. Asaf, could you say it in Italian for us? Amato Signore, Dio Onipotente, attraverso i raggi del sole, attraverso l'onde dell'aria, attraverso la vita, ogni pervadente nello spazio, purificaci e ravivaci e preghiamo, guarisci i nostri corpi, cuori ed anime. Thank you. Thank you, Amrita. That was beautiful, uh, breathing together in the elements. It really brings home uh, every day when we wake up, uh, when we focus on um, the precious lives that we've been given through the elements, the bodies. And I'd, I'd like to um, offer a uh, concentration on uh, forgiveness and that means self-forgiveness too not just forgiving others because we see that uh, when we look at our own um, inner mob that we um, don't always live up to our own ideal 
but we need to forgive ourselves for that. And I'd like to read just a short um, paragraph from Hazrat and Icon on forgiveness. And you can just feel, don't think about the words, just feel the stream of love that Hazrat and Ayakad was offering uh, as he told us these words. Forgiveness is a stream of love which washes away all impurities wherever it flows. So feel that in your own heart, that flow. By keeping the spring of love which is in the heart, running, we are able to forgive. However great the fault of our fellow humans may seem, one who cannot forgive closes the heart. The sign of spirituality is that there is nothing you cannot forgive. There is no fault you cannot forget. Do not think that one who has committed a fault yesterday must do the same today. For life is constantly teaching, and it is possible in one moment a sinner may turn into a saint. At times it is hard to forgive, as it is hard to take away the thorn that has gone deep into one's heart. But the pain that one feels in taking away the thorn Deep set in the heart is preferable to keeping the thorn in the heart constantly. The great pain of a moment is better than the mild pricking going on constantly. Ask one who forgives what relief there is in forgiveness. Words can never explain the feeling of the heart when one has cast out the bitter feeling from one's heart by forgiving. And when love spreads, all over within oneself, circulating like warm blood through one's whole being. So let's just sit with the feeling that that creates in ourselves for a minute. Breathing into that feeling in the heart. You can put your hand on your heart. Feel your breath. And I'd like to just add the phrase on the, the, the Sufi uh, word for forgiving, estafarallah, breathing it into that place of feeling, allowing a, a more spacious feeling around um, things that have... Uh, made us feel like we've not lived up to our ideal. You don't have to name them. You know where it is in your heart. Go right to it. Use the estafarla as a balm. Breathing in estafarla, forgiving yourself. You know, God is ever forgiving, all forgiving. It is our small self that holds grudges. We don't have to do that. Estafarallah in, estafarallah out. Softening, softening, letting go, polishing the heart, raising it to the ideal. the flow of love, of forgiveness. So uh, we'll do a, a wazifa practice uh, with two of the, the beautiful names um, in the family of forgiveness. And I'll just read a little bit about Yagafar is inexhaustible forgiveness. It's a healing salve that is an antidote for guilt and blame. And then Ya Gafur the essence of forgiveness because it reals, reveals the depth of the heart. So it goes right to that place that wants to be soothed and bathed in forgiveness. 
it can even go to places that you don't even know the wounds of of uh, shame self-loathing that you may not even know is there but it's a contraction around that place that you want to be open and flowing so ya ga far ya ga for so we'll do we'll do them both uh, together because they're such a beautiful couple so close your eyes and feel that place you felt. You can put your hand on your heart. Feel, feel the breath of forgiveness, the inexhaustible forgiveness that goes right to the depth. What wants to be forgiven? Ya gafar, ya gafur, ya gafar, ya gafur, ya gafar. Ya gafur, ya gafar, 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 ya gafur. Ya gafar, ya gafur, 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 ya gafar, ya gafur. Ya gafar, ya gafur, 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 ya gafar. Ya gafur, ya gafar, 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 ya gafur, ya gafar. Ya gafur, ya gafar, 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 ya gafur. Ya gafar, ya gafur, ya gafar, ya gafur. So breathing in, ya gafar, breathing out, ya gafur, inexhaustible forgiveness that touches every part, no part left out, the soothing balm of forgiveness that moves through the heart in a loving flow. Making us remember who we are. So what we can experience, we offer to the world. Amen. And I'm, I'm pleased to um, pass the class to Aliella.
Thank you, Tarana. And good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone. It's really so great that we can embrace all the globe by our practice, simply being together. So uh, I wanted to invite you to turn our attention to the one of the Inayat Khan prayers. There are so many tools on the Sufi path, many beautiful tools. We are visiting them uh, already, the breathing, meditating, saying wazaif, uh, and also prayers. But Inayat Khan prayers, uh, I consider them as a practice for real because they are not just poetic. Well, they are very practical. And uh, one of his prayers, prayer Khatum, which is actually most probably was named Khatum, which means in Hindustani uh, the final, the end, something like the essence, uh, very similar in Arabic and Persian and Hebrew. And so uh, I would say this prayer is like the essence of all in Ayat Khan message, the teaching, message of love, harmony and beauty. And each line of this prayer certainly can be subject for meditation or affirmation or whatever. So long, lifelong time. And uh, so, for example, we could follow Tarana Soferin with a uh, with the line, uh, teach us I love and forgiveness, or we could, you know, use the line, raise us above the distinctions and differences which divide, which is so relevant for our daily life. But uh, for now, let's go for the beginning of this prayer, which says, open our hearts, that we may hear thy voice, which constantly comes from within. Uh, Shakti, will you please put the words in the chat window if you can. Open our hearts that we may hear thy voice, which constantly comes from within. So it, it doesn't say open our ears that we may hear thy voice. It says open our hearts, which reminds us the heart is true channel for listening and hearing. It says that we may hear, not the listen thy voice, but hear thy voice. And uh, most beautiful that it says, which constantly comes from within, not from the church, not from the mosque, uh, for any other place. It's already within us, always. And before we will invite some music uh, to complete this practice for this line, Let's say also next line, disclose to us thy divine light, which is hidden in our souls. Disclose to us thy divine light, which is hidden in our souls. So I have a melody for these uh, lines and let's try just to experience this through the music and then we will add maybe some light body prayer uh, some movements which is helps to our bodies to our physical consciousness uh, also to feel it as real Close to us, the divine 
suggest some uh, simple movements for this chant for this prayer but they are not kind of decorative movements <laughs> to make it just beautiful it's uh, like a uh, embodiment of the prayer so open our hearts that we may hear thy voice and here in this tiny silent moment we can really concentrate for listening that voice which constantly comes from within open our hearts that we may hear thy voice which constantly comes from within and for the disclose to us part we could uh, literally go to the gallery view and to share this part with each other uh, like reopening our hidden light together this close to us thy divine light which is hidden in our soul why it's hidden I think usually the treasure is hidden. It should be hidden. <laughs> so end with someone else. This close to us, the divine light, which is hidden in our souls. And uh, we will be singing for the while and let us soft our voices and our hearts and at some point I will invite you to uh, make this practice on the breath. I guess you all know what does that mean. It's like a figure. We're experiencing the same intensity of the prayer and we're holding this in our heart and mind but uh, letting this to flow through our breath to purify our breath and to be purified by our breath. So. Thank you. 
Jesus healing in all our souls, open our hearts on the breast. this prayer <laughs> even after we're closing zoom <laughs> thank you thank you Aliyala, and thank you everyone for helping us hold space i feel there's a a nectar of a healing balm that we share with one another so beautiful beautiful practices thank you so much and we want to open to the wisdom of our greater circle if you have a poem or a short prayer or message to share just unmute hello i have a message a poem can y'all hear me yes okay well, last night I went to a sacred circle and we did a Malaysian poetry uh, thing and it's a pontoon. So I didn't have a name for it, but after today, I just got the name. It's called Remember. All is well. Life is great. Beaming bright light 
warm and fuzzy all over. Life is perfection, beaming bright light, illuminescence, perfection, beauty, illuminescence, the node beyond the beyond, beauty, great, the node beyond the beyond, all is well. Hi, I'm Vanita from Georgia, and I have a poem from um, Javis from the compilation called The Gift, and it's called Needing a Mirror. Your eye is so wise. It keeps turning, turning, needing to touch beauty. It keeps turning, needing to find a mirror that will caress you as I. Beautiful, thank you. Sakia, Sakia. Um, this is one of Rumi's poems. The early breeze before dawn is the keeper of secrets. Don't go back to sleep. It is time for prayer. It is time to ask for what you really need. Don't go back to sleep. The door of the one who created the world is always open. Don't go back to sleep. This is Shakur from the abode, from the Berkshires. This is a prayer to sing. Ancestors, sky people, all here today. Hear my heart song, hear my respect, hear my love, hear my grateful tears fall. I am truly blessed, you are truly blessed. We are truly blessed. Um, I have a poem from a book called Earth Abundance. May the sun revive your spirit each day. May the moonlight gently refresh you at night. May the rains cleanse and soothe your soul. May the winds bring you renewed strength and courage. May you roam the earth and recognize its beauty every day of your life. I had a last part of a poem, Sandra. This is part of a Rumi poem. Heart, I said, what a gift it has been to enter this circle of lovers, to see beyond seeing itself, to reach and feel within the breast. My soul, where does the breathing arise? How does this beating heart exist? Bird of the soul, speak in your own words and I will understand. Please. Malika, please take us home. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> we are so beautiful, so beautiful family. I am very grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for all the smiles. And... Que todos los seres encuentren dicha Que todos los seres Dejen de luchar, que todos los seres vuelvan al amor, la paz sea contigo. 
por siempre más. Amén. Say goodbye. Have a wonderful week. So grateful to practice with you. And I am, I've heard a promise, now that you've made it to the very end, that Abraham and Halima will return next week. <laughs> All beings be well and happy.